Good morning everybody, it's Big Ridge with Ohio Fish Rescue and today we're not even going to show you the fish tanks. This is the front fish tank you don't get to see very often, but today we got a special treat for you. We're going to come out here and we have hovers here, reapers here. We're going to go ahead and clean this pond for the summer and let you guys check that out. Stick with us. Are you done yet? <laughs> okay, we're filling this tub up with water from there, trying not to stir up that water too much, and filling this up so that we can have a place to put the fish for a while. Careful, Reap. And over here, we're trying to stay on this side of the pond so that the fish stay over there and can't get into their little uh, hideaway tube spot over here. There's a little cave here. So we're trying to stay over here and keep them that way while we're draining it. It's down about three inches now. If you can see right against the rocks right there. Yeah, it's down about three inches, four inches maybe. And uh, we're going to get this done. You know, we love all this extra work. It's just awesome. We, we've got it down probably about eight inches. And it's, it's taking a long time because the big pump ain't working. So we're using this little pump here. And Hoover, stay away from that side. You're going to make them come this way. And uh, we're getting the rest of the water out. It's coming out the end of the hose here. And uh, these guys have finished their tour. How'd you guys like the place? Great. It's great. We're yeah. Great. Did, did your dad throw you in and get the uh, no, YouTube opportunity? Yeah, sadly. <laughs> he said sadly. <laughs> See, you could have thrown him in and got away with it well, this time. <laughs> we, we bought swimming trunks just for Yeah, that I bought swimming trunks and mother's not here. I have two very valid reasons to go into the pond. Nice, nice. And this guy here, you know, he's from uh, England, and he's been here 20 years, but he just mistook. He was telling me about um, the car, and he mentions bonnet. He goes, I mean, <laughs> old habits are hard to kill, right? They are very hard, yes. <laughs> we have caught one fish so far. One little goldfish. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is, right here. here. Yep. That's how little he is. We can't see him. Uh-huh. <laughs> we've got to catch the rest of them and we're trying to keep them from going into there there's a big cave right here so we got nets on each end but there's some in there so uh, that's our problem and we just got to wait until this water gets lower before we can go in there because if we go in there it's going to get muddy real quick and we won't be able to see them so we're waiting till the last very minute before we start netting them out but if you'd like to put on your swimsuit and go in there and get them <laughs> I mean, I'm up for it. Reason to go to a pond, I will. Scoop as many as you can. Okay, there's a bunch that made it through. Just get them and bring them up. All right, uh, Reaper, take this from David. <laughs> Reaper's the quick one. <laughs> take it to him, Dave. Yes. Now, don't move, Dave. You stand still like a statue and let Hoover scare these back over that way. Yeah, it's not easy, folks. It's not easy. I'm going to get that to Reaper. Dave. We're getting them. I was trying to get in that hole. Though. Don't move that. That's a hole. Get that, Hoover. There you go. Oh, he caught it by hand and put it in the net. Kids got talent. <laughs> You're going to let him dig a pond in your backyard, right? That's up to mom. But, yeah. <laughs> Show mom the fun you're having today. <laughs> yeah, I can that anyway. Go, who, go. There you go. Whoa, you lost the fish, Dave. I got you. There's one right there, Dave. See him? Hiding in there. Oh, man, they hide under them leaves. Yeah, it was a big one, too. David in there working his butt off. He's clearing out some uh, the leaves and stuff. And the water's going down. Reaper's over here pulling out all that plant that we don't like that has taken over this entire corner, including the ground over here. It grows underground, and it's just taken over this entire corner. So Reaper has cleared it off. We've got a little bit left right here. Let me see in the camera if I can see it right there. And... Uh, We've got probably another foot and a half deep of water. So I do believe we'll get done with this today. 
All right, guys, we're over here checking this out. Reaper's cleaning out that little section over there. A lot of grass is overgrown. And uh, I wish I was recording a minute ago. He fell all the way down that hill. He was over here by Lover's Lane little seat. He laughed about it, but he won't recre recreate it on camera, though. <laughs> but that's good because you guys know we don't fake nothing here. It's all what we see and what we do. It's getting low. I mean, it's it's another another hour or so. <sighs> okay, it's getting actually lower and lower. The side shelves are showing, and uh, we're still seeing oddballs of. Uh, look at <laughs> he's finding he's finding koi in there. <laughs> Hard to see, but yet we're getting it. Reapers over here picking. Uh, grass out of the things before it gets too big you know he pulled all the grass out from around there and then we worked down here now he's on the outside because that grass just spreads and spreads and spreads it's horrible but we've got probably another hour and a half before this is empty and we're just gonna have to keep you know going away with it you know all day long until we're done josh said if we had this done by the time he got home from work which is four o'clock and it's like one o'clock now it's almost two. Uh, he said if we were done by four o'clock, then he would go ahead and change the battery on this uh, a skid steer. It's well, two seventeen. We're not going to be done by the time Josh gets home because <laughs> we haven't even started the pressure washer. You see how it's nice and white, and then it's green, and then you know it's water. Once the water is all the way out, we can pressure wash all the green off and make it nice and white. And put fresh water in, dechlor it, put our fish back in, and make it look beautiful like the day it was put in. And then all these plants are getting ready to start growing. Reaper's pretty much taken out all the bad plants and the grass and stuff. So the rest of the plants, like you can see right there, there's arrowheads growing there. Um, all around that, that otter thing there. Um, oh, in the corner behind you, Reaper. In the corner of the waterfalls is arrowheads. Um, we like them plants. Um, there, uh, here's the uh, lily pads are starting to grow. You can see the leaves up top right here. So things are starting to grow and looking good. And, uh, you know, if I can keep this guy out of my pond, he's like a turtle. He's just destroying everything. <laughs> no, he, he's done a lot of help and, and cleared out a bunch of leaves and stuff. So um, we're going to get done with this today. We just don't know what time. And I'm still going to hold Josh to changing that uh, battery in this skid steer. This guy thinks he's going to lay down and reach his hand into the 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 cave and pull out a fish. I tell him, you got <gasps> He's got a fish! Oh my God! Look at that! Unbelievable! Big one! Oh my! Oh, there's more in there. Yeah, there's plenty in there. Oh my God! He's got two. This guy is incredible. Oh, as soon as I say you're incredible. <laughs> oh, he got it. <laughs> Oh, this is the best ever. Oh, wow. <laughs> There's another one. Oh my goodness. Do you need a tank? I got I got any I got spare tanks and stands <laughs> and filters. What you need? <laughs> you have earned it. You deserve it. I can't reach him. No. Come on the other end. There's another end down here. Uh -huh. All right. Lock him I can't believe he caught them fish out of there. And you were saying I wasn't going to? Oh, I said, there's no way. You put your hand in there, they'll swim away. <laughs> there, you have totally surprised me. <laughs> Look at he's that water's like 50 degrees. He's sitting in the water. He's laying in the water. Dad, what do you think about that? <laughs> he's crazier than crap, ain't he? Oh, my God. That's just crazy. Oh, you're seceding? Yes, I'm seceding. I'm going to let the um, water clear for a moment. Okay. That was amazing. That's a, that's a 265 that leaks. It holds about 10 inches of water. And then back here, come on back here. Now, this looks like, you know, it's terrible back here, but the, the wind and the snowstorms have totally destroyed this whole tarp. But we have this 40-gallon and stand. And then we have the 75 gallon and stand. 
Um, we have this uh, 65 tall. It's the size of a 55, just taller, and stand. And there's another 75 brown with stand there. Are you interested in any of them? Yes, I am. What? I'll take that one if I'm allowed it. You want this one? Yeah. The 75 with stand? Uh-huh. And uh, you can use this. Mm-hmm. For what? Um, I have an... Three from Painted Turtles, Carl, Kevin, and George. And Carl's actually Carly, and they're trying to lay eggs right now, so I give them a nesting box. And they're in 55. Wait, you gave me way too much information, way too down. quick. <laughs> Carl is Carly. Uh, Carl is Carly, and then George and Kevin. So George and Kevin are dating Carly. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. And they've been trying to lay eggs recently, so they're going awesome. to upgrade. Awesome. Well, if you want this, I would gladly donate this to you because uh, okay. you have driven what? Five, six hours yeah. out here and then helped us all day. And then I found out you drove five, six hours. And uh, you know what? I would rather give this out to deserving people. And you have how many tanks at home? Uh, 21. And your biggest tank? My biggest one is 90. 90 gallon. Okay. So this will definitely help you out. Uh-huh. It will quite a lot. Okay. And, and what does dad think about it? I'm fine with it. He's on it. Okay, because he tried messing I with me earlier. He goes, that's why I brought the truck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh, you're playing me. <laughs> yeah, Mom wants to take the Scion. No, if you, if you can use this, uh, it's extra for us, and I'd much rather give it to people who love the hobby and want to, you know, and, you know uh, upgrade and do better and do more and... Uh, you know, and not to mention, you're volunteering around here helping I'll us out. I'll be back for some rescue cichlids no, someday. Okay. <laughs> we're going to get set up cycle. The turtles are going to go in. The 90-gallon will be open. Well, let's get Dad to bring his truck back here, and I'll we'll move this onto the uh, truck. the truck for you. He's like, <sighs> That <sigh. laughs> you know, how you go in Not only is he... Being given a 75 gallon tank, but we're carrying it to his truck for him uh -huh. while he sits here and directs. Yeah, I'm royalty now. <laughs> I have two servants. So, what we did was it has gravel in it, but we found two uh, hang on the back double waterfall filters with cartridges and a heater for him. And now they're bringing the stand out. See, guys, this is the secret. I'd much rather give stuff that we have extra to people that help us out and come out here and volunteer their time. You know, I get a million texts a day. Can I have this? Can I have that? I pretty much ignore them. So if you come out and help, you can uh, pretty much, uh, you know, let me know what you need, and you, you can take it. I'll go get you a sticker for that. I'll sign it. Okay. Hey, Hoove. Yeah. I want a um, couple of stickers, a couple of pens. These are the tops for those filters. Right. Yeah. See, Dad, now we have to buy a bag of sand, so we have a nice substrate layer for the turtles. Well, thank you guys for coming by. We appreciate it. It was very nice meeting you. Thank very you nice. Too. Yeah, don't, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt you. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'll be back to nick another tank one day soon. Okay. Appreciate hanging out with you guys. Oh, uh, you know, we just try and have fun all day and get stuff done, you know. And uh, with him here, we got stuff done. Yeah. <laughs> Do you work like this at home for your dad? It oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> Are you willing to dig the pond in the backyard? I am. <laughs> well, I See that, Dad? <laughs> I got a question now. This fish tank here is this the one that's going in the kitchen? Uh, yeah, it is. I'm no, replacing gonna a 55. To, it's going to have to go next to the 90 and the other one. That's in the uh, there's a 55, well. so next to the dog box. So this one's going to go on one side next to the 55. See, people, he has the sickness. He can't stop yeah, himself. I have <laughs> um, multiple aquarium <laughs> disorder. It's called multiple MTS, tank. multiple tank disorder yep. <laughs> syndrome. Uh -huh. well, your mother has it too. So. Uh, the old bulk reef commercials. Wait till your mom sees the tank. Yeah. There you go. Oh, she already seen it? Yep. What, she did. Still nice. Have it in the back of the truck. He took a picture and sent it to her. Right? We still have it. <laughs> yeah, she signs up on that. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and one thing I want you to tell me before you leave, Dad's got a nice truck, right? Mm -hmm. What was that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> He's like, Dad ain't got a real truck. It's only a six foot bed. I'm like, no, this is a nice truck, and you know, and, and he's like, oh no, well. I didn't 
quite say it like <laughs> that. But if you want to put those words in my mouth, I will accept them. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say about it? Um, I said... It's, it's not a sore. real truck. It's not a real truck. That's what he said. <laughs> Just like this, and I scampered off. I jumped in the pool pond. He said a real truck has an eight-foot bed, not a six-foot. This is a girl's truck, as he said. Mm, totally. We are gonna Dad, have don't put up with that. <laughs> Look, this dad's truck is now taking your tanks home, mm -hmm. hauling bikes, hauling fish tanks. That's a man's truck right there. Ah, uh, okay. And you can still, you know, get cheap gas mileage. See? <laughs> All right, well, it was very nice meeting you guys. Have an enjoyable trip back. You know, I'm yeah. sorry it's so long. You know, what, six hour drive? Yep. Crazy. But I appreciate you guys coming out today. It was fun. It was definitely fun. It was great meeting you guys. Well, we'll probably be back again soon. Uh -huh. Okay. You can come back anytime. You're more than welcome. Thank you. Have a good day, guys. All right, take care, guys. Okay. Now look how low it's getting. And I don't see no fish. You can actually see the uh, entrance to the cave there. We knocked one of the rock, or we as in, you know, Brian, <laughs> knocked one of the rocks off so we can see the entrance of the cave. But the other entrance is right back here on the backside, right there covered with rocks. So they go out there. But, you know, we're going to keep draining this down more and uh, then we can start pressure washing. Okay, it's almost down and empty. And uh, Hoover's pulling all the weeds or leaves this way, and he just found a fish in the, the, the leaves. So he's now trying to get all the leaves out. But we're getting ready to start power washing. Okay, you can see that it's late at night now. The sun is setting, the, the shadows are really extended, and this pond is empty. We're going to start pressure washing it. I don't know if we're going to get it back full tonight or not, but we're going to try. Well, you can see by the rocks that it's all pressure washed under there. We got it filled back up. It has been raining all day. So uh, we didn't get a bunch of video of that, but we got it filled back up and we got the fish back in. And you can see that the rocks aren't green under the water there. Okay, you can see how gloomy of a day it is. It's all overcast and this is all soaking wet through here. It's been raining all day. And the cars are all wet everything's wet uh, but we got the fish back in and done so uh but you know it looks a lot better by tomorrow it should be nice and clear all right i hope you guys liked the video you know stick with us for more crazy adventures and Ohio fish rescue and until next time stay fishy my friends bye guys <laughs> thanks for all your help <laughs>